Arrived right, to Junior, Popu passed away, who died a very terrible and even shameful death. We call it a shameful death because people were like, which kind of death is this? We went to shoot movies, we left home to feed home. This thing happened like, how do you think your children, your family, your wife will feel like now? Like, we don't even know who to pity again because his children just too tender for all this kind of tragic news. They are just too tender for this tragic news. We don't pray for this kind of thing to happen. And this is the worst news ever and the least news we are expecting to hear about Nollywood again. Under one month, many people have passed away in this same Nollywood industry. As we are talking all about all these things, people were like, but others passed, uh, died. Why are we only talking about Junior Pope? Junior Pope was, was found and also he is popular more than others. And also he was found before others. Others might be next day or day before, all this kind of thing. But we need to talk about the one that we know that is happening. We all know many people are dying every day, not only celebrities. This is Adam Maluk, the producer of the movie they went to shoot. And that kind of a thing happened. As she said that some collected life jackets, that he rejected the life jacket. The people rejected the life jacket because the life jacket is dirty. Therefore, me, I ask, why can't you know Pope afford his own life jacket? Why waiting for producer to do all? He believed that nothing will happen. This is not Zubi Michael. People were now blaming him. People are now blaming him that he didn't post his friend. Blah, blah, blah. That he is not a good person. Blah, blah, blah. That he should have tried to post him and mourn him. Something like that. Why? What carries Zubi Michael come for this guy that now? You can't pinpoint or even point at one person and say that this person is responsible for the death of this guy called Junior Pope. You can never ever have it in mind or even say that this person is responsible. In this same industry, Angela Okoye Wee-O is the one saying that Zubi Michael is not a good person, that he didn't mourn Junior Pope, his colleague. Why do they really hate themselves this way? Where did he get the bell? Nigeria and Astato, we can't question God why. Because he's the one that brings him and took him again. The person has already died, but when I see they talk, talk instead of prayer, where his souls continue to rest in peace, perfect peace of the Lord. Rest in peace, sir. That's the thing. This Okafo is one of the survivors, but he's the one ringing bell in this sad symbol. People were like, he sacrificed something for the water, something, something, Fanta, 10,000 naira, this kind of thing. But he never, that's what he said. He said, okay, you know how it normally happens. He has not the most knowledge enough that he doesn't want to act again. That they have poisoned him many times. Then who is that? Is it not the same Nollywood industry? Faking love upon that they don't actually love each other. Why would the director wear life jacket and didn't provide life jacket to the rest of the crew? Why didn't they take him straight to the hospital for the station? Like this kind of thing, sure. You know why all these things happen. The director have been a producer. Adam Maluk have already stayed, said that she gave some and the ones that rejected, rejected it because it is dated, especially Junior Pope. Many rumors are just fine. How he, he said they throwed Karan for him to wait. He was asking, why are these people always lying about this? Let, 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 them, let them just leave this guy to rest in peace. That's all. But for you to even feel comfortable to carry this guy matter for head, I don't even understand. You all should just rest and calm down because it is not working at all. Trying to chase crowds online because of the death of this guy. Really, as everyone is doing. What happened to the prophecy of Prophet Jeremiah and that of the seer in Ghana who specifically mentioned the name of Junior Pope? Please stop blaming people and see how to take precautionary measures. May God conserve everyone, especially the family. 
as a fact. When any prophecy is given to you, people, they always ignore it. They were like all these fake prophets up going up and down, trying to fake everything, trying to make themselves popular, trying to even feel like they are among or something like that, trying to carry someone to shine or something like that. But people should try and reason well that at times all these things is not fake. We all should try and even take some prophecies. Take every prophecy serious. That's the main reason and things that normally happen when you ignore posts like this, when you ignore people's prophecy or pastor's prophecy. And you know, don't start. You people will always find way to blame or mistakes on which one is bad and which one is not bad. You people cannot talk about them. For example, not taking him <coughs> to the hospital when it happened. Why did they rush him to the mortuary? The fact that he is dead, are they God? If the mortuary attendants doesn't have that experience, now it will now turn to another thing. People will now be, be like, oh, someone you brought someone to the mortuary alive. And that's all these things that worsen the situation. I'm telling you guys, it really worsen the situation. The time we you guys should have carried him to the hospital to save his life. You guys did on our own worst, which is very, very terrible. We are not even trying to blame anyone, but who are you going to blame? All these people in Hollywood industry trying to be like they love each other, faking everything in a way that people don't like. You see, let's just drop our comments and lines. And, don't, and please don't forget to, and please don't try to even drop any comments about blaming anyone please this is only god that will answer that question not human beings